Welcome back to JSA TV Live, where we are broadcasting from the expo floor of Yada 2024, and we are covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders across the digital infrastructure industry. Joining me right now, we've got Francesca Kane with Isotope. Thanks so much for stopping by. Yeah, thank you so much for having me. We are really excited to talk to you. Always love having you guys here on JSA TV. You recently made a big announcement about a new testing lab. Tell us more about that. Yeah, absolutely. So we just opened up a state-of-the-art liquid cooling uh, lab in our headquarters in Sheffield in the UK. Uh, we also have a new lab in our United States headquarters, which is in Raleigh, North Carolina. And so with this facility in this lab, we're really focused on enhancing high-density data center cooling, testing, and research. And what's really exciting about it is this is also going to enable customers to test workloads and really see the benefits. So instead of just hearing about the benefits of precision liquid cooling, uh, you can test your workloads and see how you can save 40% in energy savings, um, save on maintenance costs, and save on water usage as well. And saving on all of those things is absolutely critical. It's, absolutely. A, it's a mess. It's a, an absolute mess. So you've already also done some testing on high-powered chips. Tell us about that and what some of those discoveries were. Yeah, absolutely. So with this lab, we're focused on really testing the next generation uh, chips and, and for the next generation high density data centers. Um, and just to give you a little bit of a perspective of uh, precision liquid cooling, um, we say that we take the best of both worlds from tank immersion and um, direct-to-chip liquid cooling. So like tank immersion, we're extremely sustainable. Um, we uh, minimize water usage by up to uh, 100%. We don't require fans and we can actually uh, reuse the heat generated from the IT stack, so it's great for green data center initiatives. At the same time, like precision uh, liquid cooling, um, we deliver the same high performance that direct-to-chip liquid cooling offers. So, you know, we have a precise amount of a non-conductive dielectric fluid that's um, forced cooling those hottest components, which enables, you know, optimal operating temperatures. So from a cooling perspective, we're taking that to the next level. So we've done testing on 1,000 watt and 1,500 watt chips where we've shown that we can cool those and, and meet the, the thermal standards that are required for the next generation data centers. It's such great work that you're doing. Absolutely. Thank you. You've also got another, um, lots of exciting things going on. <laughs> yeah. right? you're, and, and, and I believe you're here with them as well. You recently announced a partnership with Valvoline. Share, can you share a little bit more about that? Yes, absolutely. So we're so excited about our partnership with Valvoline. They were uh, recently announced as one of our approved fluid vendors. And so uh, to be an approved fluid vendor uh, with Isotope, that means you have to meet or exceed the high standards required for precision liquid cooling. Um, so we're really excited about that partnership. We've also got some great partners with HPE and Intel, where we're focused on edge and telco solutions and really want to show the world how you know we can even save telco operators three to 5% in energy savings. So we're really excited about the partnership with Valvoline and I, I think it's gonna help benefit the HPC uh, environment as well. Yeah, and, and again, just those energy savings, you can't say enough about it right now. It's what everybody wants to know. How can I make some strides right now? Not, not in five years, but right now. And it's so great to hear that you're bringing that solution. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. Is there anything else that you're excited about before we let you go? Um, I'm just excited about kind of the future testing that we're doing. Um, you know, right now we can cool 56 kilowatts, but we're going to be taking that to the next level soon. So stay tuned for some really exciting information that will be coming out with um, at Supercompute 2024. And where can we stay connected with Isotope and everything that's going on? Yeah, so you can find us online at isotope.com. We're on LinkedIn, and um, we've also got a lot of white papers. So if you go to our website, you can um, submit to get all of the white papers that we've put out there, especially on the 1,000 watt and the 1,500 watt chip. Yeah, it's just incredible resources that are out there. Yeah. Francesca, thank you so much for spending a few minutes with us here on JSA TV, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your time here at Yada. Yes, thank you so much. I really enjoyed the conversation. Thank you. And thank you to our viewers for tuning in. Stick around. We've got a few more interviews here to come from the show floor of Yada 2024. In the meantime, everyone stay curious and stay connected.